welcome back to another weekly vlog. Thank you guys so much for joining me as I take you through another week of my average life. <laughs> so today is Monday and I'm basically just being super boring today and doing a whole bunch of work. I am answering emails, editing, um, I am also shooting a campaign currently. So I will show you guys the behind the scenes of that. So I'm currently shooting a campaign for Clarins uh, for their Reboost creams and oh my god I'm so obsessed with this one here. This one is the comforting hydrating cream and this is really really good for dry skin in the winter I have been using it for a little while now and I absolutely love it um, and then they also have the two different ones for different skin types so this one here is the mattifying hydrating cream for oily skin and this one's a refreshing hydrating cream for a uh, normal skin but yeah this is my little flat light I'm trying to be like a really good Instagrammer and like have little props and stuff so I'm trying here and I'm literally shooting it on the back of my jacket because I've left my like furry rug thing at home at my parents house so I had to kind of improvise here and I'm using my fur jacket I honestly feel so blessed that i have companies like clarins like companies that i've been using for a really really long time now um sponsoring my content like it just makes me feel so good uh especially because like i don't like promoting things that i'm not like a fan of um i will never promote anything that i just like truly don't believe in so to have companies that i actually just genuinely promote on my own sponsor my content means like the world to me today is also cyber monday so i am gonna see if i can find some deals on christmas presents and buy stuff around the house and all that good stuff so gonna be one of those days where i'm just like in bed on my laptop all day on a final note i haven't got my voice back yet like it's still kind of raspy which I don't mind, like I'm not gonna lie, I really like the raspy voice, I feel like it's like really sexy, but yeah, my throat's all messed up um, from this past weekend of just partying and having lots of things to do. So yeah, I haven't had a weekend like that in ages and I'm just taking today to recover. Um, I also don't wanna go outside either today because the weather is awful. Like it is snowing all day and the roads are just terrible. So yeah, I'm just gonna, just gonna lay low inside for now. We doing some grocery shopping tonight cause this lazy butt didn't put in the order and pick up the groceries this weekend. Right? What do you have to say for yourself? I can't complain. He actually does all the grocery shopping, so I'll let this one slide. Did all of our grocery shopping. We haven't gone grocery shopping in like two weeks because my fit meals has been hooking it up and then we ended up buying a lot of food too, so yeah. Finally have some food in the house. So guys, it is Tuesday today, and today I am running a whole bunch of errands. So first stop is, um, right now I'm at the mechanics, and I am getting Vickers Winter's Tire, Vickers Winter Tires changed, and I'm also doing an oil change for him because I'm a great fiance. Uh, and then after that, I am headed to the gym, to go see Charon and train with him. And then right after that, I'm going to be hanging out with Tia all day. We're gonna be shooting some content and just like grabbing dinner and stuff and catching up. So I'm really excited. It's a busy day ahead, but it's gonna be really good. Okay, Vickers, tires have been changed, oil has been changed, and his windshield wiper has been changed because his one windshield wiper was like fucked up. So got that done for him too. You are welcome, Vikra. And now I am off to work out. Let's go. This is how I feel currently. This is today's mood. <laughs> this is what we do at the gym. No big deal, no working out, just sleeping on benches. All right, I got in a killer workout. I am exhausted, oh my God. 
Charon like kicks my ass every time but I think that's why I feel like I've become so much stronger and like healthier and I can do a lot more so I hate him but I love him um, and now I'm headed over to Tia's house we're gonna go grab some lunch and then film some stuff and just chill out so this should be fun guess who I found not found we organized we did this plan <laughs> flopping for a while I know because I'm always so busy and she's too good for me oh, okay like, okay, okay. Like, this one's like traveling around the world okay so you're yes, one to talk have you seen Hamali's booty today? Did you vlog this morning? I did vlog. Okay, guys, her makeup is done so well. And she worked out and got her ass kicked by Charon, and yet her makeup is still flawless. Oh my god, I, I feel understand. like it's awful. There's no leakage. At that, all. No, it was awful. My eye was watering, so I fixed it. Oh, boo boo. <laughs> pretty <laughs> we're at snug harbor right now tia's favorite place yeah we're gonna order some food and look how beautiful and cold it is i guys. know it's Yummy. i hate the winter so much but it actually looks really nice here it does like the trees look so nice <laughs> Okay, the food was so good. We both destroyed our plates. There was like nothing left. This is how Tia sets up her camera. <laughs> she sits on the entire <laughs> counter. Be normal. You wanna record this or not? I do, <laughs> but like, can you just like be normal for once or what? <laughs> your face, your face. <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> this little tripod's so cute. Yeah, I love it. Cute. It was like only 30 bucks, and that's what, what? I loved about it. Oh, yeah. and there's me. Happy Wednesday, guys. So I survived yesterday, honestly. Like, I did so much yesterday. I wanted to die. I came home, and I passed out. I was so tired. Um, and then I woke up this morning with, like, a splitting headache. I don't know why. Uh, I think I pulled something while I was sleeping or something like that. I don't know, but I have the worst headache right now. But... I can't let that stop me because today I am going to go get my teeth whitened at Regatta Dental. That is where I'm headed first. Um, Regatta Dental is also the same place that I got my Invisalign done. And oh my god, they are amazing. You will see um, when I show you guys, like when I take you guys along. But um, Dr. Surfendran is like... I love her. I love her to death. She is so amazing and like the sweetest person and if you're afraid of dentists, like she is the dentist that you need to go to because she makes you feel so comfortable. Um, and then after that, I am headed to Reiki and I'm going to get some energy healing done because I get that done once a month and yeah, this is my, this is my once a month. So enough chit chatting and let's get to it. Look who I am here to see today, <laughs> this beauty, and we are going to whiten my teeth. That's right. Yes, I'm so excited because my teeth are gross. <laughs> oh, <they're not. laughs> She's the one that fixed all my teeth before. She fixed all my cavities. She yes. fixed um, my messed up like crookedness. I did Invisalign with her. She is literally the best. You guys oh, have to come to Regatta Dental. Sweet. Oh my gosh, she's awesome. But I'm gonna show you guys my teeth whitening process. So I finished getting my teeth whitened and I am so in love with them. Oh my God. Um, one annoying thing though is that uh, when you do get your teeth whitened, it like, you get like random like, like, bursts of like sensitivity in your teeth like it happens here and there it's not unbearable and it lasts like a second or two um but i didn't know that happened and then it happened and then i was like is this okay and she was like yeah it's fine so yeah just a heads up if you do ever plan on getting your teeth whitened and now i am downtown i am going to get reiki done much needed and then i'm gonna head home hopefully i can beat some traffic so this is Mendika. Hello. My beautiful Reiki girl, <laughs> my Reiki master. Um, and she is going to be doing Reiki on me. I'm super right. excited. She has her little setup there. So cute, very homey. And it's gonna be a good session. Yeah. <laughs> Happy Thursday guys. I just finished filming a tutorial for this look. It's like an ice queen princess look. 
type thing. Anyways, I made like the biggest mess ever. There is like a whole bunch of snow on the ground and I do not want to clean it up. So I'm just gonna leave it for now. I also have a bunch of glue stuck on my forehead cause this look had a ticka to it and I took it off and now I just have a whole bunch of glue on my forehead. Also, I realized how much of a difference my teeth whitening actually makes on camera. Like it's nuts. Like you can see it in person, but on camera, oh my God, I feel like my teeth are just like shining. It's so nice. I absolutely love it. Like I would highly, highly recommend getting a teeth whitening cause look how good they look. <laughs> you like my makeup? That is a lot of sparkle glitter. What the fuck is on your eyes? Glitter. Looks like dried up milky paste. They look beautiful. Do I? It is Friday. So today I've been editing in the morning and now I'm headed out to go to Sindhu's house who is EC Boutique. You guys have seen her before on my vlogs. Um, I'm going to try to figure out some of my e-shoot outfits because this weekend on Sunday I'm going to be shooting um, one of my e-shoot shoots with Narbir from R Brown Rice Photography and I think it's going to be a really cool shoot and I'm so excited to do it. So I'm going to go to her house to see if I can find some extra clothes to wear with what I'm already wearing. Um, we're gonna do about four or five looks, so yeah, I need to sort that all out. Also, side note, my eye has been watering like this entire week. I have no idea why, it's been super sensitive. I don't know what the hell is going on. So this is really, really annoying. I have to wait for it to stop watering and then I took some makeup with me so that I can fix it later. Whatever is what it is, I guess. I should just stop wearing makeup, I think. Hey guys, so I have the beautiful Sindhu from EC Boutique and we are here. She's going to be, st like she's basically styling. You're basically yeah. styling my shoot uh, for this Sunday. And so I'm gonna come pick up like a bunch of clothes. So I'm like raiding her closet, <laughs> basically. That's, that's I'm actually what I'm doing. See how crazy I <laughs> So yeah, I'm here to do that. Also, I ended up taking off all my makeup because my eyes are burning and watering like crazy. And then she showed me this, um, it's like a gel exfoliator. Gel, yeah. I don't even know what it is. I've it's never right. seen anything like it before. I've never seen an exfoliating gel before like that. I don't know, but it took off all my dead skin and like my face, oh my God, I feel <laughs> like, I feel like a snake. No, like, you know I why? just like shedded all my dead, it was, it was disgusting and like the best thing at the same time. And my skin feels so smooth, like holy shit. Um, so I'm gonna get one of those from her and I will show you guys and review it for you guys because that, that shit's amazing. It's from like China or something. Yeah, it's like a like, oh. random, <laughs> random thing, but my skin feels like absolutely amazing right now. So yeah, we're gonna get back to styling. styling. <laughs> guys, you have to come to see Sindhu for all your dress needs. Like look how gorgeous these pieces are. I'm gonna be wearing some of these dresses for my other issue as well. One of them I'm going to be wearing for this issue coming up and then um, I'm gonna be wearing like three of her dresses for the other issue I have with Divine Method. I am so excited. Her pieces are literally stunning and the quality is amazing. So if you guys are looking for dresses, bridal gowns, um, like, just like special occasion dresses, br like bridesmaids dresses, whatever, you shoot dresses, you need to come to her. So I picked up Vikra from the ghost station and now we are headed to um, Vikra's parents' house. We are taking them out to dinner for their anniversary. Do you know how, how many years they've been married? Um, Putting you on the spot. Restaurant called what is it called? Ambient. 
Ambien on Young. On Young. Um, and it looks really good. I think you found it off Blog TO. Yeah, one of those. Yeah, like one of those like blog websites or whatever. Uh, so that's where we're going. It looks pretty good, so I'm excited to try it out. I'm not a huge fan of like Indian food. There's one restaurant that I like going to in Toronto that's like Indian called Avani, and that's about it. That's like as far as like my Indian food experiences go. Um, I mean, I've been to other Indian restaurants and stuff, but I'm not a huge fan of eating Indian food outside. I'm a big fan of my mom's Indian food, so I don't really care to eat it outside. Uh, so yeah, let's see how this goes. We are reaching towards the end of the week. It is officially Saturday. Um, I have been feeling super tired today. I think I'm getting my period again soon. Honestly, I feel like my period just comes like every five seconds. It's so exhausting. I know girls will understand. It feels like you just got off it and then you're back on it again. Uh, so yeah, I think I'm gonna be getting it soon and I'm feeling really really tired um and i don't want to move but i have to because i have a lot of things to get done tomorrow we are doing our e-shoot with narvira brown rice photography and i want to get some props for it so i'm going to run out and grab some props i want to get some balloons i want to get um some like lollipops and i want to get like some ribbon so yeah which is like a random set of things but like you guys will see when you see the pictures like what it what i'm envisioning um but yeah that's what i'm gonna go do right now and then sit in bed and edit all day okay i finished up all my shopping i got some balloons i actually got some christmas stuff um, at michael's because i was waiting for the balloons and i just had some like extra time so i popped into michael's and they had so many good things so i bought some christmas stuff um got my lollipops and now i'm headed home Vikram made dinner and look at his plating skills. You're like you're like Gordon Ramsay over here. What's good, Hollywood? You're so fancy. Wow. What made you want to plate all no, nicely? No, look at my plate. I can't see it. You have to bring it here. It's too far. What inspired you to uh, plate all nicely? Because <laughs> I had like. Only a little bit of things put on the plate, so I was like... So you're like, why don't, why don't I be a bougie why bitch? Don't, why don't I try to capture your attention of how nice it looks rather than how little is on the plate? <laughs> <laughs> and it worked. <laughs> We both knocked out for a little bit because we were so tired and then we cleaned the house and look how clean this room looks now I'm sure if you guys have watched my older vlogs you would know how much of a disaster this room was it was like where we were assembling things and there was just like a whole bunch of random stuff in there so we finally cleaned it out and we also assembled these chairs that Vicar's parents bought for us which is really sweet these like bar stools 
So this is what the bar stools look like. They just like gifted it to us. They're really nice and super comfy. And um, they gave us two of them. And we have like these random two here as well that we've just been using. They're very uncomfortable and like annoying. Uh, so we're gonna go out and buy two more of these because we really ended up liking them and use them in the meantime because we have no other seating besides this. So we went to a Home Depot that was like half an hour from our house because the ones around our house didn't have this bar stool. We get to that Home Depot and find out that they also don't have that bar stool. So then we drove another half an hour to another Home Depot and now we are gonna pick it up. We called them beforehand though this time because we were like, can you put it on hold for us? And they did, so yeah. Yay, we got our bar stools. They're only a hundred bucks each with tax included, so not bad. Well guys, that is the end of my Sunday night. I am exhausted, we are in bed. We ended up setting up the rest of the bar stools, um, which I will show you guys in next week's vlog because I'm already upstairs and in my pajamas, so I'm gonna go to sleep. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and for all the love and support you constantly show me. Please do not forget to hit the thumbs up button and subscribe and I will see you guys next week. Peace. Bye. Must you? It's good, dog. Peace.